These guys are going to need some electricity. So where you put your power supply into this motor controller uh, is you use a battery pack. Now you might have a remote control car that's actually got one of these at the bottom. Um, in which case you don't need this at all. You just need to define the two wires coming out of it. There's three terminals here. The ones you need to know about for powering these motors are the bottom two. Okay, um, I'm going to put dot, dot, dot to represent the three of them. The one down here, the very bottom one, is, I'm going to write in six volts because that's what's in here. This guy can power up to 20, I think, this motor controller. Um, if you put 20 volts into this, your remote control car will fly for about 10 seconds. Uh, the motors may melt, but you'll have a great time until that happens. Um, I'm going to do a little wire like this. Okay, and the middle one is the ground. So I'm going to write GND. Okay, and yeah, the ground just goes in and there. All right, that's your basically your minus in your battery, and this is your plus in your battery. And that is part two. What kind of a face was that? Question mark. <laughs> this battery pack didn't have any insulation on the wires. You can see they're kind of just hanging out there. And the positive one's down here. Um, if you're not sure, the, the negative one is a springy one. We're going to connect this plus to this one here. So the plus to there. And we're going to connect the minus to the middle one, as we showed you earlier in the video. So plus there, minus the middle one. Uh, since we're quite near this guy here, this is our negative, and we want to put him into here for our ground, uh, I'm just going to put this directly in. For some reason, they were too cheap to use a cable, and they just took a literally a tiny piece of metal. So we're trying to shove that tiny piece of metal into the middle ground terminal there. We're also, though, at the same time, we're going to attach another cable and just leave it loose for now, because we know we need that later. So we're going to have two cables coming into this part. Um, yeah, I think this is the most finicky part, is getting two cables into that middle one. That's the power for my batteries. It's a negative, yeah. The negative batteries. the batteries. This Minus. guy here, that has not connected anything, that's for our Raspberry Pi, and we'll do that next. Cool, yeah.